baller. Take one. Action. Before we get into applying these lashes, I just want to show you guys everything that I am using. So I kind of have everything all set up right here. Got my mirror. You're not going to show me because I look crazy. Anywho, I have the lashes, of course. These are the V-Lux by IMV Lashes. Now, I do have them in medium and I have them in long. So we're going to create a little look with that. Um, I also have some spoolies. Everything I picked up from my beauty supply store aside from these two. This is a like little portable fan air conditioner thing that you can um, use to dry your lashes. Completely optional. I just got this. So again, it's optional. You don't have to have it. Um, but it just makes the drying process go a little bit faster. I have some tape. Now this is not lash tape. This is actually like double-sided clothing tape um, to keep your clothes on. But this is the only tape that I have and it works really good when I'm trying to tape up my lashes. Um, I have the Mega Hold Individual Eyelash Glue by IMV as well. This is beginning to be my favorite. I have a video on how I truly feel about this glue, but for now, this is what we're going to use in this video. I have another little device that it has a spoolie on the end and then a comb on this side. It's like an eyebrow eyelash type of a um, little tool. So I like to use this at the end as well. Um, I have my pointy tweezers. Here, I'm beginning to like these a little bit more. These are new that I received with, with the little lash fan or whatever. And I'm actually loving them. They're really, they make my lashes easy to pick up. Um, I don't really ruin lashes when I'm picking them up with these two. Um, normally, I would use these to apply them and pick them up. But these are becoming my favorites. So these are like the more professional ones as well. Um, and then last but not least, I have, have my little... Uh, presser these are like just lash strips applicators but I like to use them at the end and you will see how I use them so without any further ado let's get into this tutorial okay babe so let's hop into this video so I'm starting off with putting some of that mega hold lash glue into my little surface I'm letting it get tacky while I'm prepping my eyes so I'm using some of that tape and I'm just gonna put it on the very top of my lid and then kind of pull it up toward my eyebrow and my forehead and that's gonna allow me to see where I'm placing those lashes so I'm gonna start off with the long lashes and how I'm gonna apply them you guys will see I kind of apply them and leave like as, as as thick of a space as the lash band is because I'm gonna go in between those long lashes and then place um the mediums that we're going to use a little bit later in the video so here I'm just showing you guys kind of how the lash looks and when I pick it up and then how I actually dip my lash into the glue so I kind of just like drag it in a scoop motion if that makes sense and then I tap off the excess maybe dip it again and then tap off the excess you don't want too much glue but if you don't have enough glue on the lash the lash is not going to stick so you definitely want something for the glue in your natural lash to hold on to so um what for whatever reason I don't know y'all I know I'm sick if y'all can hear it in my voice I am sick I'm getting over this like little flu type cold that's been going around or whatever but like my eyes this entire video were just like watering like what are you crying for like <laughs> get over it what are you crying for <laughs> like so you guys will see me like trying to fan and wipe off the tears that are literally falling um thankfully for this little air conditioner fan it was helping me keep the tears in but child we were struggling with these tears i'm not gonna lie to you um and by the way I got this um, fan little air conditioner portable thing from Amazon. Make sure you guys check out my Amazon store because I have all of everything that I used in this video in my Amazon store as well as in the description box as well. So now I'm going in with the mediums that you guys see me show and I'm literally placing them into the slots that I left in between the long lashes. So we're going to kind of create a little like wispy type of a vibe, but we're still going to have volume. Um, this is my first time like doing my lashes like this. I really wanted to just try it out and see how I would like it. For me, it doesn't really give me much of a difference, if I'm being honest. Um, I kind of feel like I just have one all longs, 
but I don't know, maybe you could tell the difference of, you know, like the density and volume of my eyelashes for me. It didn't really do much. So for next time, I'm just going to use either all longs or all mediums um, just to kind of give myself a little bit more sanity. <laughs> so once I um, fill in all of my lashes, I go ahead and brush them out and I'm using my fan to make sure that glue kind of sets in while I'm taking the tape off my eye. So you guys can see the comparison between the eye that doesn't have any lashes and then the eye that I already did. So I'm just showing you guys and then I'm going to go in with my little applicator um, little tool and literally press my lashes into my natural lashes. And this is kind of a thing for me. I don't really know if it does anything or if it works, but for me, this is what I like to do at the end of my lash application. So next, I'm literally I've I did my other eye off camera. Um, I didn't want to make this video like super long just because I have a few lash videos on my channel already. But I just want to show you guys um, kind of like the ending process of these lashes and kind of give you guys the final thoughts. I do like these V-Look lashes. Um, they are $10, like $9.99 in my beauty supply store. On my Amazon store, they're like two for, I believe, $17 or $18. So I feel like you get a better deal getting them on Amazon versus going into your beauty supply store just because they got to make their money. Like, I get it, whatever. But um i do like these lashes a lot they are pretty dramatic so if you like dramatic lashes i would definitely recommend these if you guys have any question comments or concerns or suggestions of lashes that i should try make sure you guys leave them down in the comment section below but that's all for this video thank you so much for watching i can't wait to see you guys on the next one Mwah.